And people, like, they kept inviting me to come back for more episodes, and one of the crew guys came to me and was like, you guys have the most amazing chemistry. And we both were like, hmm, what does that mean? And then Joss took us aside, and he was like, so I want you guys to be girlfriends. And I was like, bad chemistry, we got chemistry. <laughs> um, I spent a lot of time doing spells in the bedroom. <laughs> so um, but I had no idea that we were going to get to go on the journey that we went on. We were so lucky. I know Allison feels the same way that I do, that we were so blessed and so lucky to go on this journey, to walk in their shoes, to be a part of something that, you know, the show itself is magical and transcends just being a TV show, but that relationship specifically transcends just regurgitating someone's lines, you know, like, you are a part of something bigger when you're a part of, of, of a show like Buffy. And, um, you know, the fact that we got to be the first long-term lesbian relationship on network television was really, really important. And, uh, in fact, our, our prop master said to me, because we were, so we were told we weren't allowed to, like, hold hands or kiss and stuff in the beginning. The censors were really like, no, 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 no. Um, and so, uh, I think, Alan and I both were very like, that's annoying, that's not fair, you know. They're on tombstones! <laughs> Put on plenty of body things! <laughs> <laughs> I, I remember walking into Joss's office and he's screaming into the phone and he yeah. goes, They're kissing! End of story! Yeah. <laughs> Hi, James, what's up? <laughs> I know you guys are upset that you're not able to, to, you know, show the physical side of the relationship. He's like, but what's important is that you are playing two people who happen to be women who fall in love with each other, and you have a real relationship, and you treat each other well, and you're going out into the world on TV screens, and you're showing people that this is normal, and this is okay, and that if they have a problem with it, then they have a problem with all of us. Just like in family, like, if you're part of the group, and if you have, if they have a problem with it, they have a problem with it.